Hey guys, welcome back to another session of Poppy DK. And as the description and the title says, this time we'll be showing you how you can get unlimited storage on your Google Drive. So let's get started. So here I am in the uh, Google Drive section of my Gmail. So <clears throat> what we will be doing is we'll be using multiple uh, Gmail to get the combined storage in a single single Gmail. Okay, so let's say I have logged into four gmail here so this is number one this is number two this is number three and this is number four i'll show you here again so let's say this poppy dkt123 is the primary mail where we need a huge amount of storage and these are some other email addresses so basically what we'll be doing here is it's a very simple trick everybody of us is aware of it but we hardly use it so today i'll be showing you how we can use it so as I said, this is our primary Gmail and here, let's say this is now zero bytes, nothing is consumed, but let's say it is completely full and 15 GB is used up. So what we have to do is we have to simply get multiple Gmail and combine the storage as I have said. So the email address says poppydktest123 at the red gmail.com. Okay, you need to remember it, poppydktest123 at the red gmail.com. I'll be moving to my second email and I'll be creating a folder here, new folder oh no no not this I need to uh, create a new folder I'll be right clicking new folder and let's say storage one create okay after the storage one is created we have to simply go here and click on share and here we have to give the email address poppy dk test one two three at the rate of gmail.com so done and we'll be clicking on send so it is done now let's move to here the second email address I'll be right clicking again I'll be clicking on new folder and I'll be naming it as storage storage 2 basically like the uh, drive of our PC we are creating multiple drives again i'll be going here share and i need to put the email address again that is poppy dk test one two three at the date gmail.com yeah it's done i'll be selecting it and again send okay the permission should be edited okay and the final one i'll be right clicking again new folder S-T-O-R-A-G-E storage 3 I'll click on create and again here I'll click on share and here again I'll be selecting pop it ticket test my bad P-O-P-I-T D-K-T-E-S-T test 1 2 3 at the rate of gmail.com BAM this is done so basically what we did is we created three folders every folder is of 15 GB and finally we'll be coming back here and I'll be refreshing this page this is our main email address poppet decade test here see poppet decade test 1 2 3 and I'll be going to no, not here I'll be going to share with me see storage 1 storage 2 storage 3 so basically here it is showing 0 bytes of 15 GB used but here actually we have 15 15 15 45 GB of shared storage and 15 GB of primary storage and after this if you lose, lose your access to the other email addresses that is also fine you are the editor of these three storage and these three storage are your storage and you can use it so basically we have used a very simple technique that is provided by Gmail which we all are aware of and we can make unlimited storage in our Google Drive. Now I can use this storage to upload anything, do anything to this storage. So guys there is one very important thing that you need to keep in mind while you are doing this is that you need to perform the entire operation being in incognito mode otherwise there might be some error so it's always suggested to use the incognito mode while we are performing this. I hope you have liked this video. I